Lebracha, holy souls, holy souls that your source is divine and godly and ancient and pure. I want you to remember that you are holy beings and that your souls are who you really are and your bodies are only the vehicles to carry you in your mission to connect yourselves to the Creator back again. The Creator is the endless sea of your souls, of our souls, and He and us are one. When a person is sinning or committing crimes, violating the rules of violating the rules of creation so by that he's creating separation he's connecting himself to his physicality and disconnecting himself from his spirituality and by that he's losing the real spiritual source of his being who he really is and falling in the trap of the evil inclination to think that he is a physical body with shape and size and measures, colors and physical qualities but in reality you are a holy soul so when a person is doing tshuva and by that removing all the husks and coverings that are blocking between him to Hashem so then he sees only the good of his being and he's coming back to that unity Coming one with the Creator that made him to be who he is. Now I'm calling you to recognize your godliness, to see the beauty of your souls, to complete your tshuva, and to understand how gorgeous and fantastic you are, because you are. And the evil inclination, the Yetzirah is always, always on our back to tell us bad things about ourselves, to think that we're ugly, that we're disgusting, that we're not wise, that we're not nice, that we're not wanted, that we're not welcome, that we are not perfect, that we're not good. All those lies, all those filthy lies, negative thoughts, that their root is coming from the bad words and negativity of the evil inclination. To do a complete tshuva, it's not to hate yourself, it's not to blame yourself, it's not to judge yourself, it's not to criticize yourself. To do complete tshuva, it's to come back to the place that you came out from, it's to come back to who you are. Who you are is a godly soul. Who you are is a higher soul than the soul of an angel that came down to earth on a mission so come back in tshuva and come back to your true self be who Hashem sent you to be an ambassador of the good to reveal the godliness of the Almighty to recognize His beauty that it's your beauty that it's the beauty of His creation and you are His creation so recognize your beauty. I bless you with one billion blessings, endless amount of light, complete salvation and redemption in our days to all of us and to all of our beloved ones. May the blessing of Hashem illuminate our hearts that our self-esteem will rise high and our self-confidence will shine again that we won't lack our inner faith and our inner confidence in who we are and in the Creator that sent us to this mission. I bless you to have Shana Tova, a blessed year and a sweet year, Umetuka, and that we all gonna meet each other soon in the Beit HaMikdash and gonna dance
as one person with one heart. Amen. Ken Yehiratzon. For more, please visit emuna.com. May your light shine always, and your request should be answered with the greatest blessings. Amen.